Welcome back, YouTube fam, to another AFK Arena video. And, uh, honestly, this is more of a request video. I can't do this because I am saving all of the gems. Also, we had a great first day for gems. I think we went up, we went up about three or 4,000. But I need somebody to try this out. We're going to try this out right now on a very small scale. I only have 20 scrolls. But I need to know if this works. If this will actually increase your wish list. Let me see if it says anything. Elite heroes. You can hold up to five heroes. So it says up to. So that's important. Elite heroes have a greater chance of matching your wish list heroes. If any elite heroes are produced. However, the overall. Okay, the odds. We already know that. Removing all heroes and leaving only one hero in the wish list will not increase the odds of that wish list hero being produced. It says that. Hmm. But hypothetically, I want to know, will it decrease the odds of the other heroes being produced? Because it does say it will not increase, but reason that I think it makes sense that it will is the other heroes are not there. So, hmm, I don't know, that's a tough one. I still want it tested. You know, please, if anyone is willing to um, possibly even make a video on this, I will link to your video gladly in the description down below if anyone's willing to give it a try. When selecting heroes for your wish list, newly added heroes will have the word new displayed on their portraits to help you more easily find and add newest heroes to your wish list. Now, I don't expect it to give us like five times the odds of getting these heroes, but what I'm thinking is that it will lower the odds of getting elites that are not on our wish list. Now, I, I could be wrong, but all we have is this sample size. I apologize. I wish I had more. I really do, but I'm not spending one diamond for a year. It's important. Okay, let's see. First one, ah, uh, no elite. That's great. That does not help us. And second ten. All right, we have one elite. What's it going to be? And this is one that is not even on our list. Or was it? No. No, because it was uh, Shamira. Huh. So this is not a good example. It did not work out for me whatsoever. But the assumption is that it's going to not increase the odds of these specifically, but decrease the odds of the, the heroes that are not these. I mean, if not, then what the heck is it for? <laughs> if it doesn't make it more likely for you to get those heroes over other ones, I don't know. Um, sorry, this is a bit of a short video. We did make a little bit of progress. We are up to 1021. Oddly enough, I am stuck on a level that is not a, uh, a boss level. I've gotten extremely close. I've gotten to where it is one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. This is not one of those runs. <laughs> but uh, time always runs out if it ends up to be one-on-one. -on -one tower we're still stuck on 141 and we have two more spots in the guild i have to boot i really did not want this but omega if you ever see this video you are so welcome back marley mar if you ever see this video you are so welcome back friend request <laughs> i'm sorry marley mar and i'm sorry omega but we have two more spots 81217 you only have to be level 30 and be active, that's about it. Um, Ira. Ira's um, off and on. Hmm. Where are you, Omega? <sighs> Maybe he logged in. That'd be awesome if he did. Oh well, I'll find him eventually. And it looks like we're going to win our first war. I was ranked 4th, I guess. Let me see. Oh, I got knocked down. Way down. How'd that happen? Let's see. Only one loss knocked me down to 50... <laughs> to 58th. Wow. That's a, that's a pretty big loss, then. I thank you all for watching. I can't wait to see what the rewards are from a, from a victory. But uh, if anybody's willing to try that out with a good sample size, I want to see if it makes a difference. Um, Y'all have a great day!